Hello everyone, we are going to continue uh, the ratio booklet page 3. Question 7, here I have 3 ratios, A to B to C, 12 to 6 to 4. That means that A is 12 and B 6 and C is 4. You should write them. Okay, then let's read first. You want A to B to C, 12 to 6 to 4. The three numbers are divisible by 2. So you're going to make divided by 2 on the calculator. The answer will be 6 to 3 to 2. A to C to B. A is 12. C is what? Is C is 4. And B is 6. These three numbers are divisible by 2. So you're going to make every number divided by 2. The answer will be 6 to 2 to 3. B to C to A. Same. Here you want A and C, so A is 12 and C is 4, so it's 12 to 4, and order is very important. 12 and 4, they are divisible by 4, 12 divided by 4, 3, and 4 divided by 4, 1, so the answer is 3 to 1. C to B to A, C is 4, B is 6, and A is 12, divisible by 2, so the answer will be 2 to 3 to 6. Here, I want to simplify the following ratios, 54, 63, and 72. Let's see. If you add these two digits together, the answer will be 9. And you add these two, it will be 9. And here it will be 9, so it is divisible by 9. So every number, you are going to make it divided by 9. The answer will be 6 to 7 to 8. 72 to 27 to 12. Here, if you add every two digits, you are going to find that it's in table 3. So 7 plus 2 equals 9. 2 plus 7 equals 9. 1 plus 2 equals 3. So the three numbers are divisible by 3, so you are going to make them divided 3. On the calculator, it will be 24 to 9 to 4. Here 180, 18, and 36. If you add the digits, also it will be 9. So every number is divisible by 9. After I make them 22 and 4, let's see here, is, is it the simplest form? No. All of them are even numbers, so you are going to make them divided by 2. Every number divided by 2, it will be 10 to 1 to 2. And here also divisible by 3, the 3 numbers, the answer will be 3 to 15 to 2. Here I have 250 grams, 1,500 grams, 2,250 grams. First of all, you are going to cross the grams because ratio, I do not write any units in the ratio. All of them in table 5, so it will be 5 to 30 to 45. Again, you can make it divided by 5. It will be 1 to 6 to 9. Here, the length of the three pieces of cloth is 1,200. The first is 350. The second, 200. The ratio between the three pieces. Then I want to find the third one. How can I bring the third one? You will bring the total minus the first plus the second. So it will be 650. Now I can bring the ratio easily. You are going to cross the zeros together. Then they are table 5 divided by 5 and you will find the answer. Here also 16 hours, 88 hours, 4 hours. You are going to cross the units. Then 16, 88 to 4. All of them are divisible by 4. Then you will bring the answer. Here, 8, 6, and 2, all of them are divisible by 2. Make them divided 2. Then also the units are divisible by 2. Divide the 2 another time. And you will find the answer 7 to 29 to 3. Here, the length of 3 pieces of cloth, 850. The first, 250. The second, 400. I want to bring the ratio between the 3 pieces. So first of all, I must bring the third one. The total minus the first plus the second. The total will be 200. Then you are going to put the three numbers. And all of them are divisible by 5. Divided 5. And this will be the answer.